Hello and happy Wednesday to you. Today I'm using ColourPop Sparkler. This is one of my most favorite ones ever. And I'm going to show you something. Oh, did I close it? Yep. Hold on. I've mentioned her quite a lot. Um, I watch her every morning, just about. And she's the one that um, recommended like L'Oreal foundations and stuff. And um, everything that she's recommended, I've been totally happy with. And I wanted to show you because I always talk about her and I'm doing this halo-like eye. She did a green one today, but I wanted to do this color pop. But anyway, here she is. If you want to check her out, she's very friendly and just a good person. Okay. I usually, I don't talk much because I'm, you know, up with my son, getting him going and things like that, but... Okay, which brush? This one. Okay, we're going to start with this darkest. I don't bring up a lot of sad stuff, but I just wanted to acknowledge that a beautiful, strong young lady um, left the earth yesterday. Her name was Selma. I think she mainly just did Facebook stuff. And she just had a heck of a life. And now she's free of the pain and suffering. And I just wanted to acknowledge her because she was something. Just going to blend this a little bit. Oh, my son was asleep, but I can hear him. Okay, did I get a wipe? Nope. Went a little far here. Hold on. Okay, now we're going to use this one. Yes, that will take care of my fingernails. I was looking for new colors yesterday, but same old stuff. I was going to go out today and get some things done, but we're, I'm going to use my finger now. We're receiving emergency alerts and everything about the weather and the wind and um, possible zero visibility. And <laughs> so it's definitely not the day to go out. Okay, now I'm going to take this and this and blend them in the crease. Really hope I can get out tomorrow and get to my doctor's office and get my lab work. Okay. 
And now I'm going to use Revolution Raise the Bar Highlighter. I'm also going to put it in the inner corner. I'm going to use Maybelline Tattoo Studio 36H brow pencil. At one point it was a pencil. Oh, now I got sparkly all over my face. I do anyway, so. Okay. Um, now we're going to use Maybelline Colossal Mascara, and I will do that and be back. And we're going to use this one for the lower lash line. I'm using an angled brush for that. I'm just taking it about halfway. Okay, I'm going to finish the bottom lash line. I'm using Revlon Colorstay Micro Liner in What the Fudge. I'm going to use that for the top lash line. Whoop. I'm going to use my fan and I'll be back I'm using e.l.f. Flawless Satin Foundation and is there a color? I don't see one. My hair is wild, huh? I got a new crimping iron and I never used it before, so... Okay, I'll be back. Okay, we used Sparkler by Colourpop. For lips, I used Lorella Liquid Lip Tempted. And then Lorella Lip Gloss Best Life. Just put a little in the middle. Milani 08 Tea Rose Powder Blush. Elf Bronzer Palette. Hold on. Okay, my child <laughs> used Revolution Highlighter, Raise the Bar, Elf Flawless Satin Foundation, Maybelline Colossal Mascara, um, Maybelline Tattoo Studio 36H Brow Pencil. There you are. Revlon Micro What the Fudge Eyeliner for top lash line. Um, I think that's it. Oh, and I don't know if I said, but I also used um, this for cheek too and brow. Okay, hold on. Okay, here is your closer look. And it's supposed to be a halo. <laughs> the um, the darker colors really kind of blended a lot. So, but it works, I think. Um, I'm sure I'll probably be back tomorrow, hoping I can get out to my doctor's office. We'll see, though. You never know the weather forecast and what actually happens. So thank you for watching. See you later.